I'm Randy Vance. I'm on the Snake River today with the folks at Moto Jet Boats and Enmar Marine Engines. Now, Moto Jet has been building extreme high performance jet boats for really rough water since 2012. But that company's heritage dates back to the 60s when the grandfather of the founder of this company started Weldcraft. Now, there's a new step in Moto Jet's evolution today, and it's coming from Enmar Marine Engines EcoBoost engine. That's a 2.3 liter turbocharged 310 horsepower engine. Super quiet super powerful and super maneuverable. I've got Patrick Riddle today who built this boat. He's going to take us out and give us a shakedown cruise and tell us how Motojet got into Enmar Marine engines for their boats. These boats are capable of doing so many different things. I mean, we spent a lot of the day just kind of riding around easy, enjoying the rapids and doing some nice sharp maneuvering. Your customers use them all over the place. Tell me about that. Yeah, we have customers in, you know, all over the world. We've sent boats um, overseas. They're used for every kind of water, white water, lakes, definitely the shallow water, smaller rivers and creeks. Tell me about one of your experiences running them up rapids. Uh, where we are, Hell's Canyon, the Snake River, Clearwater Rivers, we're not really in the best place as far as shallow water for what our boats are made for. So we run a lot of white water when we take them out. The Snake River's got, you know, class four rapids. The Salmon River that comes into it's got class four and five rapids. They do handle white water really well. This is actually the first boat that we put an EcoBoost in. My customer who um, was kind of still us to borrow it today, Jesse Oviet out of Spokane, Washington. We had him sold on this boat with a different engine in it but due to lack of supply, we weren't able to get that engine. And so it was kind of our chance at MotoJet to kind of pounce on finally getting to do an EcoBoost, going over the capability of it, the horsepower, the 350 foot pounds of torque, way more torque than the engine he was going with before. It was just a no brainer for him to go with the EcoBoost, especially for what he's using it for. He's running lakes, Hell's Canyon with his family, going camping. So it's got all the capabilities of running the bigger water and it's a smooth ride for him. We've done probably five or six more since then. Tell me a little bit more about how the engine works in this boat for you. What do you feel when you yeah. kick on the throttle? We primarily deal with PwC engines, which are under 300 pounds for the engine itself. The EcoBoost adds a little bit more weight, but in this size of boat, it's better bow up a lot more, you're not plowing. It was a lot better ride and a lot better fit for this size of boat. They're very quiet compared to any other engine we've done. You can sit and have a conversation when you're running down the river. We don't run mufflers on these boats, we just run the exhaust right out the back. They don't need it, they're so quiet. Tell me how that torque feels when you're working the throttle and making turns. Yeah, the maneuverability is really good. You know, it's got really good throttle response. It's really responsive, really snappy, and it's gonna go when you want it to. The EcoBoost is really easy to put in. We didn't have to learn anything new. The nice thing about it's plug and play. It comes with a five-year warranty. The load capability with the EcoBoost in our boats is a lot better than what we were used to. We're able to get on step quick with more weight and cruise at lower RPMs and stay on step. The low RPM gave us a lot of better acoustics, better control over the boat. We're not having to hammer down the throttle to keep it on step. To keep it maneuvering, it carries its momentum really well. And it's just been overall a uh, great setup in our boats. After spending about two hours on the Snake River in the MotoJet powered by the 2.3 liter EcoBoost motor by Enmar Marine Engines, I really got a great feel for how this motor feels in this kind of application. It's a lot of hot dogging around with the other boats and we had a good time. What you learn doing that is that that 4,500 RPM, 310 horsepower, high torque motor really gives you a tremendous amount of control. I'll tell you where you really are going to appreciate it. It's when you turn from up current to down current and down current to up current. You can really feel the responsive steering that comes from that torque. 
Aside from all the performance and speed, when you're really going to enjoy this engine package is when you're idling along on the river and you want to listen to your tunes without having your eardrums blown out by the motor. Can't believe the acoustics of this engine and how pleasant they are when you're drifting along and enjoying the day. I'm Randy Vance.